In 2011, Sandy began her quest in Germany, where she set off to commence the 22,000 kilometer expedition for the shores of Australia. It has been quite an adventure for Sandy, traveling to countries she has never been before and experiencing cultures and the way of life of the people she passes throughout her journey. The last five and a half years kayaking across the world has not just been a physical battle, but it has also been a mental one. Being on her own and at sea has been something she has had to deal with. She is now in the final leg of her journey. My big thing is I love long expeditions and this one by Oscar Speck really like inspired me because it seems like the longest kayak journey ever made and he did it solo and unsupported and continuously. Um, so I was really impressed by that and uh, nobody had tried to retrace the journey in modern times so I thought I'd give it a go. And an important message she would like to get out is regarding the preservation of marine life and ecosystem that surround us. After Port Mosby, she travels through to Daru, where she will make her way across to Australia to complete her five-year expedition. Although she has been by herself on the kayak from Germany, she certainly has not been alone in her cause and is thankful for the support behind her. Following the completion of her Germany to Australia quest, she plans on going a step further than Oscar Speck and writing a book about the adventure. It shall be a remarkable accomplishment for Sandy to have undertaken to single-handedly kayak from Germany all the way through to Australia. And she is without a doubt proven her determination and will be the only person beside Oscar Speck to have embarked and completed the journey. To Miss Sandy Robson. Shane Saroya, National MTV Sports.